Well, hello, I'm Rick. I want to show you uh, a few things about Navari, which is a flight planner and an autopilot for flight sim or X-Plane. Uh, when you start it up, you see this with the autopilot settings. You can change those values before you create an actual route. Okay, first I'm going to show you how you work with your mouse. It's not quite difficult, but just click away this click away this okay uh, what we have here is uh, the world when you click with a left mouse button it centers on the mouse click that's how you navigate through the world so just click once on the mouse on the left mouse button and you go there the right mouse button is to select any waypoint airfield anything when you're in flight planning mode, there's another mode in uh, autopilot mode, it works different, but in flight plan mode you can uh, uh, set a arrival or departure airfield and select your route, select waypoints like this, right mouse button, right mouse button, right mouse button, and if you enter the wrong one, just press the mouse wheel. The mouse wheel will delete the last entered waypoint, like this. You can all delete them if you like. I'll go to uh, Vancouver, which is here. If I right click here, right click with the mouse, Vancouver will be my departure airfield. If I go up to here and I click right again, this will be the arrival airport. Now I can choose any highway or any waypoint, any fix NDB or VOR beacon to get a route. You can also fly via the highways, which I'm going to show you now. Uh, first we go to the south. To Here is a VOR beacon. You will get that one. Yes, IVR. And it should take Fexto as the next beacon on that highway. So we go on. You see the yellow cross there, here, Cassidy. And again, and here is Aru. Now we go up. I hope there is a. Yeah, there's a waypoint, Royce. So now we are flying highway. Then we go to the airfield itself. There. And finish by clicking flight plan. This is the flight plan. You can calculate, but first we are going to finish the route by going to the airport info. Now you can really finish the route up to the runway. What we'll do is you see the arrival airfield here. We're going to create a teardrop to land on the north runway. So we go to uh, this was our last entry. We go to Ebnog. Aglad, we click here, it gets a fix. There's the fix, Gadar, and then just a few in the arrival. And it should be okay. Then we go to Vancouver itself, it takes a while. There it is. And here we go from uh, Gabor, I think. Gabor to this one, and then to the south but not that steep on yes there it is we go to here and then it takes a nice round now we go back to the flight plan flight plan calculate descent and it calculates all the descent points which is 120 to go with the speed to 250 knots we have here uh, the top of descent uh, flying 160 is not very high, but that was set in the in the uh, uh, autopilot settings. So and this is the route. So it's it's not connected to flight sim or explain, so I can't show you how the autopilot works. But if you click once on a lateral nav, it searches for the nearest waypoint. If you click twice, it enters the it activates the waypoint. If you don't get a waypoint, your nose is to the wrong direction for any waypoint to see. 
So just wait till you're on the runway. It should be okay then. But you can always try. Uh, vertical nav, speed, and here two arrows for uh, get to the last waypoint, get to the next waypoint. Well, the rest will uh, get you on the way, I believe. If you clear, the whole way, the whole uh, flight plan is gone again. Just click OK now, and you see the route. You can click away everything else. You don't need anything. So this is the route, and it will fly that route completely automatically if you like. OK, now I'm going to show you how to insert a route from uh, a site. Okay, now I'm going to show you how to uh, enter a string with uh, the root. You go to this site, rfinder asa link net free, which is a free uh, root calculator. And you put in two uh, airfields, CIVR for Vancouver, and uh, take uh, CIPR Prince Rupert, and uh, check the altitudes. You can put anything in here. What's important is that you choose the right cycle. If you don't choose the right cycle, sometimes the route can't be created. So I'm going to find route. And it gives a string with all the waypoints and the highways. And this string is important. You can copy this string by control copy. And then you go to back to Novari and you press the flight plan button and the import button and you get this string. This is the same site I got it. You uh, paste it in, control V and then OK and it calculates the route and here is the route. You have to finish it by uh, creating the departure and arrival route. But the uh, big lines are here, the big highways. Uh, when you go to, for example, flight plan and airport. No, not the airport set. This one. Airport info. You can create a nice, very nice teardrop to fly it to the north. Go to evil, go to the, and there we are. Now you can go back to the flight plan and then calculate descent. And that's the route from the internet site. Asa Linknet, it's quite easy.